it's important for me to make sure that everyone knows that this was filmed during the third, I think, initial alpha of Creator World. And also a little while ago, I had a horrible flare up and couldn't edit the video until now. I was also starting to get the flare up when I started filming this video, which is why it's a little bit lackluster in places. I hope you enjoyed anyway. Hello, my loves. I acknowledge the fact that no one really knows me on here yet. Uh, as I'm about to say, this is going to probably be the first video on my channel. But as you get to know me, and you realize the things that I like, it will make perfect sense that the first video on my channel, despite the fact I had plans, I had so many plans. I had a pack of in the works, I had a bunch of Sims, Sims 2 stuff going up. It will not surprise anyone by the time you get to know me that the first video that actually hits my channel is this. Because I love creating worlds. So today I am so excited because I'm going to be trying out Twisted Mixie's Create a World tool. Now it is still in alpha. Um, I have pledged to his Patreon to get my hands on it. It has been out for a few days, um, but I haven't had time to make this video and I really wanted to record it. I did ask on his Discord if I was allowed to make a video about the alpha and he said yes just to please make sure everyone knows it is still an alpha and it is it, it's it's very much in alpha it doesn't even have an export tool yet um but that said i'm really excited for it people have been asking a lot of questions in his discord you know will we be able to do our own apartments yes will we be able to pick where our lots go yes will we be able to um I don't know, there's just a lot of different things. Um, I've always loved uh, world building tools and stuff. I used to play with The Sims 3 Creator World a lot, <laughs> a lot. I, I really did. Uh, I never published anything. I was a lot younger then and I never really finished anything, but I loved creating worlds in The Sims 3. And I think I'd given up entirely on the idea of a Creator World tool for The Sims 4. Uh, I think Arnie is an amazing modder. I use a couple of his mods, but I've never really been particularly interested in his style of world edit. Not because it by itself is bad, but because it, to me at least, it, it took other things out of the game. Like I really like his farm, farmland mod as well. And I'm hoping that uh, I can use it without having to replace a chunk of Brindleton Bay. Um, but I've never used the farmland mod, I've never used the world edit mod particularly, and I've never used Nando's uh, trip to Egypt, trip to Greece, trip to whatever other worlds he's done. I think they are amazing modders and they impress me no end. But because it replaces other things, I for one, I love Strangerville. Uh, you'll see how much I love Strangerville if you uh, subscribe to me. If you hit that subscribe button, you'll see how much I love Strangerville. So the fact that, that Egypt replaces Strangerville, I didn't want to do that, so I didn't. So I'm really excited to try this Creator World tool. I don't know what I'm going to create yet. I'm probably just going to play around with the controls and just see what's possible so far. I don't have any custom content in, so I'm using for... because you have to create a save uh, and just load in a, 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 a save. So I've created... I've got my myself sim and made her uh, vanilla and I'm gonna use her and yeah we'll go from there um, I as I say I'm very very excited I do not know what I will create but I'm excited to put custom content in like I, I feel like I'm gonna butcher the name but little Dika little Dika Little Dika uh, created recently uh, like a fake shell window. I think that'll be really cool for Sims 4. Uh, let's do spring. Actually, summer's probably the best. I can do a plum bottom in person. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's, um, let's slap down in Newcrest because it's nice and empty. Just, just, just shove, uh, just shove, shove myself in here, face first. I, when I first watched the, uh, the, the, the launch trailer for Creator World, this, the, 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 
when I first uh, loaded this, like I, I, like I waited because I've been very impressed by everything that Twisted Mexi does. Uh, the better exceptions, the better build by the tool mod, especially. Um, I've been very, very, very impressed. And when I saw that he was dropping a trailer for Project Raven, I waited with bated breath. Uh, one of my parents came to talk to me and I was like, no, this is about to start. I've been waiting for this for 24 hours. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> um, and when I watched the trailer, I actually cried. I started crying. I was so blown away by how it looked and what it could mean for the future. And truly, I am so genuinely impressed by everything he's done. Okay, get started. Let, let, let's do it. God fucking damn it. Come in! World's shortest terms of service. This is an alpha copy of Creator World. Car. Project Raven. Car, car. Things can and will change. Your worlds may not work in future versions. Do not use on important saves. Don't complain. Do you understand and agree? I agree and will con complain vociferously, but mostly at myself. Now a love letter. Literally years in the making, Creator World is my most ambitious project. It wouldn't be possible without patrons like you. Your support has been overwhelming and so appreciated. But I ask of one more thing. As an early access member, I depend on your feedback. If you notice bugs or have suggestions, please stop in my Discord and let us know. Creates a better mod, not just for you, but for everyone. My Discord link is on twistedmexi.com. Thank you, sincerely, twistedmexi. You seem so nice as well. Um, I am part of the Discord, so if I do hit any bugs, I will be like stopping to... <laughs> Let them know. Uh, great. Where do you want your author name to be? Public and tied to your world. Sinful Simic. Nice to meet you, Sinful. This is so professional. Like, okay, I'm gonna click install. So while it does that, I'm gonna. This is so professional. Like, impressively professional. I expect a level of professionality from mods these days. Not because. Not just because of the fact that people have impressed me all this time, but because we have more tools over time. Like, I've been playing a lot of The Sims 2 recently, and most of the mods in The Sims 2, you have to, like, stick an object on your lot. Like, you want autonomous casual romance? Stick these phone books down. You want a loan? Stick this loan jar down. You want college tuition? Stick this... Stick a football? I don't know. It's weird, it's like a football with a face on it. Um, and over time, because The Sims 3 really took it further, you didn't need objects as much, it was sort of linked to... Okay, I have to restart my game. It was sort of linked to... You good, me? You good? Okay. So, I'm gonna save it and restart my game as told. Um, but then The Sims 3 came along and mods were no longer like linked to objects the same way. I remember one of the first really big mods that I loved for The Sims 3 was probably the online banking mod. I loved that mod. And The Sims 4... The Sims 4 itself I have problems with. Uh, I'll get into that in another video at some point. But the mods for The Sims 4 have always been mind-blowingly professional uh i mean look at sim realist sim realist you would not if someone if someone sat me down and i didn't know anything i would think sim realist was just part of the game and i'm very impressed by the level of professionalism that comes with the modding community of this game and it's lost my sims again come on <sighs> I won't find my goddamn game. Why? There we go. I had to click off and on again. Okay. Oh, and if I look like I'm a drowned rat right now, it's because I just bathed my ducklings. And Ooh. I'm gonna just I'm gonna just 
I'm gonna just. I haven't played this in a while, so everything is. I'm. I'm gonna just. Uh. Give my little Sims self somewhere to run into and hide. Oh, I've been. I've been playing Sims Two recently. Go sit. Okay, there we go. I've been playing Sims Two recently, and really, okay. I've been playing Sims 2 recently, and so now I'm, I'm clicking down here trying to find the the controls, because that's where they used to be. Okay, so I'm going to save again, because I've, I've given her a little... It's not a particularly nice room, but it's a room. Also, can she get into that side of the bed? Because they scooch across now, don't they? Fascinating. Okay. Create a rain. Create a rain? <laughs> Create a world. Okay, so how does this how does this work? How do I how do I do this? How do I do I go into manage worlds? I'm guessing. Should I read the instructions? Do I have instructions? Let me go look at the instructions. I have it, I have it in an email. Uh It's on the Patreon. A lot of this is going to be me just working out, trying to work out what the heck is happening. Like I said, I, I absolutely will be complaining, but at myself. I have this thing where whenever I'm learning something new, I always, without fail, I always feel like I'm looking up at a window. And I know if I can just reach that window, I can climb in. And I can rummage around in that building and I'll be really happy. But there's just a brick wall in front of me. There's no ladder and it's the ladder up to the window that I have problems with. I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense. Okay. Um, how is it going to work? What to expect? What to expect? Concerns? How to use? Uh, it doesn't tell me. Am I missing something? You will load a household on a lot in the template world you'd like. And you should find an extra... Oh, okay. Okay, that was my bad. You will lo load a household on a lot in the template world you like. So I'm in New Quest. So that's the... So that's the world I'm in at the moment. I hate this. It's because I keep... I keep moving my documents folder in and out because I have Creator World and I have my Packacy and I have other things that I'm doing. So it keeps trying to decide if I have like a, a new it, it thinks I've only just installed which I haven't okay so we go back down to this lot click it to enter the world builder oh, but I don't have the template world this isn't the template world is it this is just a normal world have I fucked something I don't have anything else in this folder, I just have this. I think I fucked something. Yeah, I've I've messed something up here, haven't I? I have screwed something. Ooh, this is cool. This is really spawn. That's so cool. God, they, he's worked so hard on this. This is cool. I've fucked something. I've definitely fucked something. Do I need like is that like a video that would explain this, or is this the trailer? I'm not logged in. Oh, it let me in anyway. That's nice. Yeah, that's the reveal trailer. Do I have to move my sim? Hold on. Maybe I have to move my sim out. Fucking hell. I need to, to find a, a version that... Okay, move out household. 
I don't have the template world. Why don't I have the template world? Okay. Let's go to the Discord. Okay, TM, Cal, reinstall. Go back to where I am. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> to clarify, it's the actual game, not not the creator world. I hate those things. I hadn't realized how much I hate those things until I. I... Apparently I full ass didn't finish this thought, but what I was trying to say was that I hate those things that I hadn't realized how much until I was editing my Pakistan challenge and I had to listen to them over and over again. Ridiculating rivers. I love that. <sighs> Please note, this is entirely on me. Like, it works for other people, it's just me having a problem. We may end up uh, stopping and then coming back to this in a day or two. I do admire how much work running this must be. You can't see this, but I'm sitting in the Discord and I've got my problem and two other people have got problems and they seem nice too. Like they don't seem like bad people at all, but he's having to triple fist like three different people trying to help out and sort of fix things and oh, I, I i i would not want to be him <laughs> i admire him but i would not want to be him i spend the next hour i think trying to get this to work i'm gonna skip over that because it's just me sitting chewing my mouth picking my face and staring at my screen and occasionally typing uh, I will say that Twisted Mexi was incredibly helpful and I felt utterly ridiculous when I found out what the problem was, which I think I will probably be telling you further on in the video. Let's skip over it. Okay, so it was my fault. I have a non-standard uh, resource.cfg because I have... Uh, I have, oh my God, I have override setup. So I have a non-standard CFG file, resource.cfg file, because I have um, resource, I have override file set up. And it added, it, it appended to it without realizing that I had, you know, a non-standard one. And so it, 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 it got confused. So I need to fix that. I'm going to take that resource file out. I'm going to put it somewhere else. It doesn't need to be there. And then I'm going to load it back. No, no, I don't want to load the... <laughs> I nearly loaded The Sims 2. And then we'll load it back in. I may have to regen the... Why won't this just permanently record? I really don't know why it keeps losing the game every time. I may need to regen it again. Yeah, I have to regen it. So let me do that again. Okay. So we're loading in again. And then I have to install it again. But that's fine. At this point, we're just completely used to that. Oh, for fuck's sake! Why? It's not installed yet. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. It's not installed yet. It's possible because I haven't installed it yet. No, that's not going to be it, is it? How 
how else have I thought of this? Tired. Tired, annoyed. Again. Not by Twisted Mexi. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. Okay. So we've got it working. <laughs> and now I don't know where I want to go. So we have Forgotten Hollow, which I've actually never fucked with. I've never fucked with Forgotten Hollow. There's Solani. My heart. I love Solani. My heart and soul. There's Del Sol, which I do like, but it's just disappointing. Strangerville. Also my heart and soul. I think we're gonna have a look at Glimmerbook. Let's have a look at Glimmerbook. Let's see how that looks. Looks exactly the same. How does this work? <laughs> okay, I'm going back to the instructions. <laughs> going back to the instructions. Okay. Load a household installation wizard new sections. Need and saves you don't care about. Saves work in progress. You'll load a household on a lot in the template world you'd like. Okay, so I need to move. I need to move my my little sim sim. I need to move myself sim to. No, I don't want to visit. I want to move. And we're going to move to pretty place. And we're going to move into the empty lot that has like two trees in it. Okay. that oh it's a person why is that a person i don't want there to be people hold on i don't want there to be people hold on <laughs> i did have my real i realization recently that the reason i don't like the sims 4 is i don't like the spawned in townies and that other households let's uh this takes ages fuck I should have loaded like an empty save. Is that like a cheat? I don't remember if there's a cheat to do this. Fuck. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Where'd my game go? I like that this is like in-game. Creator World is always such a clunky tool for The Sims 3. Okay. to use select something from the build by catalog can i move this or is this like part of the like how do i hmm okay see the number one issue here to me at least is i don't actually use tool not often anyway uh how do you activate an object how do you open tool Special drop downs to the creator world objects. We can switch to regular build by filters as well. The toolbar at the top has a double square icon. If that's highlighted, group selection is on and you'll be able to click multiple objects at once. Ooh, that's cool. Okay. That's nice. Okay. Hey, look. There I am. Um. I don't know how to do anything, <laughs> which is problematic. Is it old? Is it shift? -T? Shift T. Okay, shift T to toggle. That's that's. How do I do anything? I don't. Oh. 
Okay. Okay. Can I not get rid of this? Like, this is the thing that's pissing me off. Okay, let's let's maybe sneak it part part of a lot or something. <gasps> I think that's part of the lot actually. Okay. I I assume that the reason I assume that the reason that most of this is the way that it is, um, is because you can't delete stuff on the fly. Do I put that down? Oh, woo, cute! Okay. Uh, mm, not not quite what I wanted. Okay, hold on. Didn't I see there were like? Ah, oh, to switch to rotation. Harbour homes. I don't know what I'm doing. I was just really excited to experiment. Ooh, okay, can I just place that then? Nope. How do I like tell it that I'm happy with it? How do I tell it that I'm happy with it? Hold on. Oh, you can change the scale. Space bar. Oh, I have a bridge now. Can you walk over that bridge, I wonder? Okay. Please don't expect anything good from this. I'm just looking at it. I'm having a great time. Uh, damn, okay. What's that? Arch. Hmm. As I said, I, I don't, you know, see the Batu stuff? Is it Batu? 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 I don't know, but the, the Batu stuff? Like, that's gonna be really nice in Creator World. People are gonna be buying Batu just for creator world and that makes me laugh to think about Ooh, okay that feels like scale Not quite what I had planned there. What the fuck? <laughs> Hold on. Oh, okay. I was doing it wrong. Oh, and we have a house. We have a house. I put a house down. This is nice. Okay. I'm more excited. I will say I'm more excited for like when... Uh, you can put down, like, I don't know, uh, <sighs> my brain is not a functional anything, actually. Oh, that's nice. Um, I'm more excited for when you can put down, like, what, I can't move that now? Lots. When you can pick where you want to put lots. That's going to be cool. It's my lot. It's my lot in life. That... Not quite what I, I was doing there, but okay. Oh, I see. I think if I can do this with Tool in the future, I will use it more. I've never liked how awkward the rotation is until that smaller than I said. Oh, those are weeds. Those are weeds. I thought they were trees. So we have trees now. Um, could be like a really dense city with this. Not with this one. Possibly with like Newcrest. But this is really cool. I, I don't know what I'm doing with it at the moment. Um, I may enjoy it more. <gasps> ooh! Ooh! Okay. Ooh! I may enjoy it more when... Uh... With more functionality. That isn't to say this isn't fucking amazing. It is. It's just that I don't know what I'm doing with it. Um... We don't have little medieval houses or anything. We have hydrants. The one thing I used to really want to build 
on Sims 3 was there was an episode of Stargate Atlantis and there was this really dense little walkable city almost uh, a lot of red brick a lot of, of um foliage and things like that and it was this gorgeous little town it wasn't quite medieval it was a bit further on the medieval it was the one with the guy that everyone loved i hated that guy <laughs> like i just didn't enjoy those episodes at all but i loved that that town and i really wanted to build that in the sims 3. i never did I don't know why I never did, but I never did. And I'd really like to do that here. Containers. Oh, we could do like a cyberpunk town. Knowing what people... See, knowing what people do with tool on just lots, I... Honest to God, I cannot... I... Oh, it's going to be amazing what people do with this. I'm, I'm moving somewhere else. I'm going to try a flat world. Uh, just go to manage worlds. I'm gonna move my my sim self. I'm gonna go, go to one of the flat worlds. Do you think Newcrest is flat? I think Newcrest is flat. I'm about to find out the nowhere's flat. Also, I love Solani. I'm so excited to be able to have like another Solani. Um, let's move them. Okay, let's, let's move back out here. Let's move into Fern Park. Let's see what this is like. This is the... I did pick the blank new quest, right? I think I did. I'm not sure I did now. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. One... one... <sighs> this world deserves more as well. This world deserves more. New... Magnolia like, Promenade is gorgeous. It deserves more. No, I don't want to... Why would I visit my own? <laughs> this is excitement. This is excitement. Okay, let's let's try this. Do we get new crest after Magnolia Promenade? No, 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 we didn't. We got new crest because people were complaining. Surely. I'm looking forward to be able to put down my own roads as well. I'm gonna do like a duplicate of Pleasant View, I think, or Vernaville, or Strange Town. That would be fun. Look at what is that? What is that? Are the flowers? It's fucking bizarre. Cool. I love this. God. Also, I will. I will give them their due. The worlds are really pretty even when there's nothing around. Even when there's no even when there's no like extra stuff, the worlds are pretty. You know, it, it, it's not It's not the end it's not terrible. Like they, they did really well with aesthetics on the Sims. Oh that one. Oh, I see. I was like, I paused it. That's weird. Okay, we're going to try and make this into like a dense city. That's what we're going to do here. That's what I'm going to do today. So we're going to start with buildings. Oh, drops. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Can I like register all these and see them, please? No? Okay. Um... Surely there's a city backdrop. I mean, I know there is because I use it in the Sims 2 all the time. Panorama. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Okay, can we do... No. Yes. I accidentally put on my tab mode. Not quite what I had planned there. Okay, these controls are really nice. I would like an ability to rebind them. Because I'm not left hand not right handed for this at least. Okay. Alright, uh, let's let's I probably need to scale that up. Oh, city backdrop. Is that an alien city? That's an alien. 
Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you, Sims. I have questions. Okay, uh... Old Town... Old Town... Island... I... That... Like, oh, that's cute. It's not what I want, but it's cute. That plays something... Oh! Wow! <laughs> oh, okay. Cool. All right, I guess. This is this is fine. Where'd that one end up? Oh, why does it only want to be over there? String it down. Okay. to the background of new quest. <laughs> no it isn't, it's just living. Okay. So there's one. I mean, I'm not gonna pretend this is good. I know this isn't good. But I'm working on it. Alright. Let, let's try going to some let's try going to some architecture. Uh I'm gonna start here. cute actually i like that let's try putting it Do you know as much as i love i know what i know what i'm doing i'm fucking this up completely as much as i love city living and i really do i haven't played with it as much as i would like i really should play with it more in case you all haven't noticed this is not a review by the way my 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 gold star review of this is just fuck yes give me more I'm very excited to see where this goes and what progress he makes with it. Okay. And then... Oh, I love that. I wish these were real. That sounds weird. But I, I love these shells. The art direction of this game is really good. That's, that's my statement there. But the art direction of this game is excellent and i i wish truly wish that they were allowed to do more with it oh look at that look at that okay we're gonna do i think we're gonna stick to brownstone and in this particular spot we're gonna stick to do these have swatches no they don't okay we're gonna stick to Brownstone here. Not that we have more brownstone options. Nope, we only have one. Okay, uh, what's that one? Also, I love brownstone. Like, I really love brownstone. A lot. Rotate. Nope. Nope. That way. These controls are fabulous my lights are flickering why is that the one i already used no it isn't i may not film all of my messing around with this i may mess oops i may mess around with it off Camera. I just really wanted to film a little bit of it. This is very, very user friendly. Um, it's not perfect. Like when I was using uh, Creator World for. Sims 3, uh, I definitely preferred the fact that it felt like an engine, but for, for, the, for everything that Tool is and everything that Creator World is and everything that Sims has said that it can't be, that it is clearly becoming, 
Um, this is fucking amazing, and it's very user friendly, and it's very, it's just good. It's just good. It's just good, and I freaking love it. I'll probably do more with it when the the future technology is more out. More out. Fuck. Do I know how to speak like a human being? I don't know if I do. I will probably do more with it when the technology has come further. But I am very, very excited to see what other people do with it. I'm very, very, very... So today, today on Twitter, um, yesterday on Twitter, Nando was talking... Fuck. Oh, there's a Nando picture! Okay. <laughs> either today or yesterday on twitter nondo was talking about um how the future of his uh world mods are going to be integrated they're going to be done like this custom worlds that you can have I'm just putting in on myself here to say that actually what he said was that his next world, uh, Breeze of Greece, that one will be done through Twisted Mexico's Creator World Tool. I'm like 99% sure that's what he said. I may have dreamt it, but I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what he said. Uh, not, as far as I know, he's not like redoing Egypt or any of those, though I really hope that he does in the future. I just wanted to make sure I got this clarified. Okay, my anxiety got the better of me. I went and looked it up. I found the tweet. I'm going to put a screen cap of it on the screen right now. That's the actual word of God from Nondo. Thank you. As someone who really likes the look of his creator world and has always really wanted to... Not creator world, sorry. His worlds. And as someone who's really wanted to play them, I'm downright enthused because... I really do want to. I just didn't want to have to give up Strangerville or the other worlds to do so. Um, so yeah, I'm thrilled. Like genuinely super thrilled. Um, I think I'm gonna move that one. That one's, oh, I know what I'm gonna do. Can I just, can I just click and move? How do I get this to move? Hold on. How do I get this to move? I don't remember the, the... how do I get it to move? Oh, I know. See, this bit is less user friendly. This bit is slightly less user friendly. We gotta click it, but that could that could easily be that I don't know what I'm doing because, like I say, I don't use tool. Can I add? It's like a way of adding to this. I know there is. Fucked if I remember, but I know there's a way of adding to the active object. It's not a big deal right a second. I'll, I'll figure it out in the future. I think what I'll probably need to do is try and invest some time and energy into learning tool. Um, I'm not much of a builder. I say that a lot. Um, I love what people do with tool. I saw someone turn uh, the candy making machine or the, the cupcake machine into a medieval cupcake machine with tool. Like completely CC free, just tool. And I'm very excited to see what people do with Tool in that way in Creator World. Although I assume it will explode computers. But I've never really used it. I'm more of a gameplay simmer. Uh, I do build sometimes. I'm getting more into it. I've got a I've got a thing on the go that I'm working on where I'm building my own save as I go. So I don't download any lots from the gallery. I start with a completely blank world and all the sims and all the lots are built by me. Created by me, built by me. And I really like that. Like I'm enjoying that a lot. And I'm also doing my sims, my sims uh, 2 save, which has got a lot of my own building in it. And sims 2 building is something else, something else. Sims 2 building is something else. And as much as I'm really enjoying the sims 2 building, because I am, um, I like that. That looks lovely. Um, as much as I'm really enjoying The Sims 2 building, and I am, uh, I do find that it, it is hard. But I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the building. So I'm getting more into building, and I think I need to commit some time and energy to learning tool. So maybe I'll do that soon. 
I think I'm going to leave this here for today. Uh, I've installed it. I'm looking at it. If you haven't already pledged to his Patreon to get access to uh, this, you absolutely should. Um, I'm genuinely awed. I'm awed by how much work has gone into this, and I'm also angry. I'm angry because of every single time that EA, who have access to the source code, hours and thousands of dollars worth of manpower, um, I'm angry because they say that you can't do this, and look. Look what he's achieved. And I know that he's got a lot of help from other people, I know that he's been working on this for a very long time, but he's one dude as far as I can tell. And he's achieved this and this is the pre-alpha this is the this is alpha 0.01 it's not even alpha one yet and it's astonishingly good and i am angry that ea have been outright lying to us outright lying to us for years saying it's, it can't be done it's not possible i wish they just had the goddamn balls to say we don't want to give you creator world. We don't want to give you that power because I think that is the truth here. I think the truth is that EA don't want us to have it. I have a hunch that what happened is when they released Sims 3 creator world and people started creating these amazing worlds, people stopped buying the store worlds as much. That's my hunch. I have no proof of this, but it's my hunch. And I, I think that's probably why they didn't want to do a creator world for the sims 4. ironically i think that people are going to start buying sims 4 packs solely to get their hands on the creator world things to use with creator world you know the the strange of the, the batu shells the the townhouses from discovery university the 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 whatever the heck that that's not an apartment that's a motel whatever <laughs> the, the 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 individual pieces i i can see people putting money into to get them and i think they have completely missed their opportunities i think they're stupid but i always think they're stupid um i can't wait to see what people do with the batu arch and you know all of this stuff i can't wait to see what people come out with and i will be doing stuff too I will be doing stuff too. Just not yet, <laughs> because I don't quite know what I'm doing and I think I will want more I will want more of the ability to change the terrain and the roads and be able to do like Pleasant View or have lots and lots of lots and things like that. I am very, very excited, very, very enthusiastic and yeah. So thank you ever so much for watching. Uh, I'll do something more with it in future, I promise. I swear I'll do more with it in future. Thank you ever so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!